feel this. This is kind funny. Of way. Look at Lamont at because Lawrence walking like through my area. You know them, right? Look, that's the Paul Brown it's Stadium. Like you know them, but they don't know you. Walking through Cincinnati, talking about adventures with purpose. Lamont at Lawrence. This dude rode through my city, dogging out the people based off of how they look. Now, I don't like Lamont at Lawrence, but I do respect him expressing how he feels. But I did make a video a while back when he was right over the bridge to where he's at right here in my city of Covington, Kentucky. He was passing judgment on people in my city without even knowing them, calling it one of the crappiest looking cities he's ever seen, calling them trash. But to see him in Cincinnati a lot, it's kind of worrisome a little bit. Like, what are you doing? Like, seriously. But whatever. It's like all these nerds with the Ryan Up Church guy. Huh? The fuck? It's been a grind. But this I makes me think this dude's watching me, bro. Some might say perfect. With the Ryan Up Church guy? Like, you're defending a guy that sings a song you like. Other than that, this guy appears to be nothing but a phony and a bad actor. This guy went from, oh, oh uh, what happened to the Kylie Rodney thing? All of a sudden now, it's uh, she never existed. She's probably an actress. She's a paid actress. And now she's like hiding. She's in hiding right now. Her parents are crisis actors. That guy's nothing but a drug-addled goof. And all of you nerds out there who defend this insolent clown, <laughs> you should actually be ashamed of yourself. You should actually... Dude, all you do is walk around everybody else's towns talking about everybody else. That's all you do. You do nothing but walk around talking about what everybody else has done, did, said, or what. What makes you so fucking special, bro? You ain't special. Without everybody else's story, you wouldn't have any content. So, honestly, keep Ryan's name out your mouth. Because if he wasn't somebody, then you wouldn't even be talking about him. I've addressed you, and I don't even think you've addressed me back, because I'm nobody. Say what you want about Ryan. He's allowed to have his opinion. If that's what his opinion is, that's what his opinion is. In the mirror and say, wow, I'm defending a guy that sang a song that I like, that I really like, but he's going to go off and say that this is a fake case, this never happened, and I have yet, I have yet to hear anything about him donating that uh, that car or that cash. Again, I'm not slamming adventures with purpose. I'm just trying to make you guys realize that yeah, they're doing a good thing, and they get paid very very well to do it. Police get uh, police do a very very good thing, right? They don't see uh, nearly the money that these guys see. And I'm not saying that cops should be paid more for the job that they do. The only reason why you brought up Ryan is because his name rings bells in the Kylie Rodney case. Period. And two months later, you're going after Adventures with Purpose leader for, turns out, he's a rapist. This is two months ago, guys. That's all I got to say.